There is one thing that I would say almost any creator on YouTube could be doing, but most creators on YouTube are probably ignoring. And that's a shame because this one thing could result in a lot of views that are simply being left on the table. In fact, I would say that in the age of AI, it's almost irresponsible not to be doing this one thing today on YouTube. So let's chat about it. Captions. Why are they important? How can they result in more views? And how can you add them to videos easily? And let me know in the comments, are you taking the time to actually customize your captions for your videos? Because it seems that these days, a lot of creators simply ignore it. They let YouTube's AI handle it and they move on with their day. Meanwhile, 400 million people are deaf or hearing impaired and they depend on captions to consume video content. Now, YouTube's auto captioning software has come a long way, but it can still do a pretty eh job sometimes. In my experience, it has a history of getting words straight up wrong. So in short, captions increase accessibility. Not only are they great for people who are deaf or hard at hearing, but they're also great for anyone who happens to be watching your content without the sound on. Maybe they're out and about using their phone and they don't have their headphones that day. It doesn't really matter because those viewers still deserve a positive experience when they come to your channel. And by the way, Captions increasing a viewer's experience on a video isn't just me saying that. A study conducted by Oregon State University reported that 52% of students found captions helpful as a learning aid, and it helped improve their comprehension. Additionally, Meta said that when it added captions to its ads, it increased viewing time by up to 12%. And that's for ads. Imagine how much higher that number might have been if it was on regular content that provided some kind of educational value or just pure entertainment. So yes, captions are super important for video quality, but but they can also get you more views in YouTube search. YouTube search algorithm can actually read the captions of your video and then surface your videos to people who are typing those keyword phrases into search. So even if your video doesn't in the title or description explicitly state keyword phrases that people are typing into search, that video could still surface in search results. One example of this in practice was a study done by Discovery Digital Networks. They concluded that captioned videos on YouTube had a 13.48% boost in views in their first two weeks after being published. So caption Captions on your videos are super important, but we're not just talking about your long form videos because I don't know if you've noticed this, but captions on vertical short form content are also used quite heavily and also very important. In fact, I would say that half of the YouTube shorts that I watch have some kind of captions that pop up on the screen. Sometimes the text is even animated in fun ways and it becomes part of the content itself. And I don't know about you, but a lot of viewers out there, including myself, watch YouTube shorts with the sound off. So in my opinion, Captions are really important for shorts, maybe more so than long form videos. Even if your video is short though, captions can still take an excruciating amount of time to do yourself. So I have some tips to help speed things up. Before I explain how to add captions easily though, I really don't wanna to forget to quickly mention subtitles. Captions are there to take the language that's being spoken in a video and translate it in a way that can be read in real time. Subtitles on the other hand, are for taking what's being spoken in a video and translating it into a different language. So this is yet another quality update that you can add to your content optionally if you would like to try and reach new audiences with your content. Subtitling could potentially lead to more views, but I would look at your analytics. What countries who watch your channel house the largest percentage of your viewers? If subtitling is something you would like to try, then I would say to start with the languages that are dominant in those top countries who watch your channel. But yes, all of these things do amount to extra work on a video that is otherwise already finished. There are a few resources that I'd quickly like to share though that can help speed things up. First and foremost, we'll start with the free method of doing it yourself. Well, it's not as bad as you might expect though. All you need to do is upload a video to YouTube and wait for it to finish all of its processing. Once it does, YouTube will have already done its job and taken all of the things you've said and made it into a caption file. It'll look a little something like this. If this were me, and it is, from here I would go in and start capitalizing different letters, adding punctuation, and making sure that everything that was said in the video is actually here accurately displayed in caption form. Manually doing anything even like this is still gonna take a good chunk of your time despite it not being super difficult. A service we often use though to do this for us is called Rev. Rev is relatively affordable and they turn things around for us pretty quick. We're not sponsored by them, we just use the service quite a bit and they do a decent job. For YouTube Shorts, this could be a little bit different. There are a couple tools I would recommend like Kapwing or Type Studio. These tools can actually help you get on-screen captions quickly and easily. The truth is though, there's actually a ton of tools out there, even AI tools that can do a fantastic job captioning your videos and they will produce a caption file for your long form videos that you can easily upload. Or for shorts, they will just 
put captions directly on the screen for you and then you can upload that file and be done. So just be sure to do a bit of research and find a tool that fits your style. As more creators embrace this practice, the ones who do a good job captioning are gonna stand out above the ones who aren't taking it seriously. So until YouTube's AI tools get up to scratch, I would be adding captions to your videos as often as possible. Of course, captioning tends to happen later in the process. What's also important is getting people to click on your video in the first place, and I've selected this video right here to help you do just that.